I lost the original beanie that I was wearing, so I got my Paris one. But the deal is done. I paid for it. I called them. It went well. Um, so I'll have it tomorrow about like 11 a.m. And yeah, my new boots, they give me about three inches to height, which is hopefully good enough for the GTS. I am five feet. I think I really only need to be like 5'3", I feel, to comfortably like touch it more but I was able to tippy toe it I was in sneakers and that was with the original seat so I'm almost certain that I will be relatively okay all right you guys the scooter was delivered they came all the way from Lawndale to Anaheim and um everything went well I didn't record it because when I was really nervous about that and to um didn't really want to be on camera anyways but there is a photo they took of me that they posted on their page that you can see um at six scooters on instagram and that's s-i-k-k -K. i'll just tag it here in a text and you can go check that out so i've decorated the new bag gave him my signature um shout out to discount moto gear for the good deal uh, I got this in shop and I was feel bad because I went in like five minutes before they were closing but they were so sweet and they were like take your time and and everything and sorry I just had to cut this little piece is kind of getting me annoying right here and um yeah they were nice and they they let me get what I needed. Unfortunately, this one didn't come with straps. So, I pretty much just MacGyvered the straps. I just went to Joann's. And, you know, Joann's is really inexpensive. So, I was able to get the straps for like six bucks. And put them on. So, I know it's really dark. So, I apologize. But a lot of it is down here in the back. So I'm going to use a conjunction of these and some zip ties, and I really do think that'll suffice. And um, my dog, Al, has a tendency to attack my hair, to take my hair ties. I don't know who else has a dog that likes to steal hair ties, but um, mine does. So I'm always having to buy some. But I wanted to show you guys one more thing before I put it on my scooter. was how deep this bag is. And I apologize because I'm filming with one hand and I'm very improper when it comes to filming because I've realized like filming shouldn't be so stressful. I got one of these little nice smell good bags and I like keep that in there. And then um, I got my extra pair of gloves. So and then just a random protective bag, my wallet. So obviously I'm gonna put that in my purse and my DIY license plate that I'm so proud of. I just painted it with uh, acrylic markers that I bought from Ross, Dress for Less. Because I'm all about discounts and secondhand stuff, so. Speaking of which, I came up with a name for my scooter and I will show you guys that here in a second. Pretty much the only thing that I'm waiting for is my custom seat, and I think she will be complete. The delivery man is here, which means one thing. My cover seat is here.
This will eventually mold much like this did over time with like the heat and sitting on it. Um, the same thing will happen with this one. Um, so it always looks like this the first, the first week I would say. We are gonna go ahead and install this bad boy. It's really easy. As you can see, you can see where the screws are. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, remove those and put this on there. These are in pretty good. So we're gonna go ahead, get one that's slightly longer, and then I'm gonna see if that works. I was able to get these, and they fit much better. And I found them a lot easier to screw in, so. I'm going to go ahead and finish that. And we're done. This will eventually mold much like this did over time with like the heat and sitting on it. Um, the same thing will happen with this one. So it always looks like this the first, the first week I would say, but I'm very pleased with everything. She's heavy. She's a beauty. Thanks for watching.